Hey everybody, Andrew here from Tip B, and in this video we're going to show you how to set up emoji keyboard shortcuts in iOS 5. Uh, this basically makes it a lot easier to, to get emoji icons in your text messages or your emails or your iMessage, whatever it may be. So in order to get started, you're going to want to jump into the settings app. Um, before we can actually enable the feature, we have to make sure that the emoji keyboard is on. So let me just go back here and show you what I'm doing. You're going to want to jump into the general settings pane, scroll down until you see keyboard and tap keyboard, and then tap international keyboards. And you'll want to tap add new keyboard, and then you'll have to scroll down and find emoji. It's right there on the list. So tap that, and you'll see that it adds the emoji keyboard there. You'll want to go back here now, and you can see there that you can add new shortcuts. So now that we have the emoji keyboard activated, you'll want to add a new shortcut here and switch over to the emoji keyboard. And I'm just going to do a smiley face to give you an example of how this works. So you'll jump out of the emoji keyboard and back into the regular keyboard layout. And then you'll tap the 1, 2, 3 button in order to bring up... Uh, uh, the colon here and then the parentheses and then that's that's pretty much your shortcut there and you just save it uh, I'll just jump into spotlight and give you an example of how it works um, there you go so that's gonna save you a lot of time usually you would have to uh, jump into the emoji keyboard uh, you know navigate to whatever you're looking for in this case it's gonna be a smiley face but again to show you how it's done one more time, just jump here. There it is. So that's going to save you a lot of time. It's a lot more of a, uh, an efficient way of, of getting your emoticons in there through the emoji keyboard. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. And thanks for watching.